It was Fat Tuesdays, which means today, for those who mark this occasion, it is Ash Wednesday and services will be different this year, but churches are making accommodations because this is a tradition. It is a sacred tradition for so many as they are altering the way that they are going to look to keep everybody safe. Khalil Maycock talked to a couple of pastors about the changes in this year's celebrations, how they're going to look and maybe how it's going to feel for those participating. Good morning. Good morning, Elias. Yeah, the pastors I spoke with tell me the traditions of Ash Wednesday are very important. And one pastor in the Catholic Church tells me this year's services will look similar to those in ancient times. Ash Wednesday, it marks the beginning of the 40 days of Lent, time set aside by the church to uh, call us to a deeper renewal of our faith and our trust in the Lord Jesus Christ. A trust that will start off a bit different this year for those in the Catholic Church. The Vatican sent down rules stating placing ashes across the foreheads of parishioners like this is not allowed in 2021. So instead, this year when the priest says, Remember you are dust and to dust you shall return. It will be said to the whole congregation and the placing of ashes will look more like this with the priest or pastor sprinkling them on top of your head. Something Pastor Frank Frank Cheeto also says is an ancient custom. But Heartland Presbyterian Church will still be placing ashes across foreheads. Pastor Alex Thurnborg says to be COVID friendly, the service will not happen inside. Instead, you'll drive up, stay in your car. Uh, I'll be wearing um, uh, a mask and a shield. Then you'll get at your ashes and drive away. And Thornburg says it'll be the first time he'll be seeing some of his congregation in the worship capacity in over a year. And we thought this, this has some risk to it, but um, it would make it more meaningful for that kind of interaction. And Pastor Cheeto says with these changes, he hopes everyone who shows up is understanding and appreciates the fact that we are still imposing ashes. And services at St. Anthony's for their English Mass will start at 8.30 a.m. and 5.30 p.m. The Spanish services will start at 4 and 7 p.m. And for Heartland, they will be holding their drive-up services from 5 to 7 this evening. Clear, let's